Hello guys, in this video, I will guide you on how to fix Android TV voice control Google Assistant not working. So if you're having the problem where you press on the voice control button or the Google Assistant button on your Android TV, but nothing actually happens. And even after you long press on it, it does not show anything and you cannot give commands to your Android TV. In this video, I will give you several solutions that might help you fix this problem. The first and the easiest solution which actually works majority of the time is to simply hard restart your android tv the way you do this is to simply just unplug your android tv from the wall socket so just go ahead and unplug it from the wall socket and once it is unplugged from the wall socket you want to wait for about 10 minutes and after the 10 minutes you want to go back and plug your android tv to the wall socket again try to turn it on one more time and then try to use the voice control google assistant button on your remote control and see if that will fix the problem for you but if that does not work out for you another thing you want to try is to check your internet connection on your android tv the way you do this is to simply just navigate to the settings or the settings icon over here so you want to come over to the settings icon and then go over to the wi-fi settings so here we have the network and internet settings select that and then you want to make sure that you are actually connected to your wi-fi or your hotspot network and there is also internet connection in fact make sure that it is showing connected over here if it is not showing connected then it most likely means that you do not have internet access on your wi-fi or your hotspot network so make sure you actually connect to your wi-fi and then go ahead and try it again and see if that will actually fix the problem on your android tv if after trying that the voice control google assistant is still not working on your android tv another thing you want to do is to just head over to the settings one more time so navigate to the settings icon again and then you want to just scroll down to where we have the device preferences over here scroll down to the date and time settings and then make sure that automatic date and time is not turned off so you want to make sure that it is set to use network provided time you have to make sure it is set to the correct date and time depending on your region Sometimes this might actually affect your internet connection which in turn will affect the voice control Google Assistant from working on your Android TV. If that also does not fix your issue for you, another thing you want to do is to simply just go back to the settings again and then here where we have the apps settings over here, you want to go ahead and select apps and then just scroll down until you get to the apps permission settings over here, select that. Now you want to scroll down and then look for the microphone just to be sure that the mic on your Android TV is actually working or the mic from your remote control on your Android TV. So you want to just make sure you enable this for all of the applications you want to be able to use your voice command. If you want to use it on the Google Play Store, make sure you enable it from over here, but make sure it is not turned off for those specific applications you want to use it for. Now, if you do this and the voice control Google Assistant is still not working on your Android TV, the final thing you want to do is to simply just go over to the settings of your Android TV and then you want to scroll down to where we have device preferences over here. Select device preferences, then scroll down until you get to the Google Assistant option over here. Go ahead and select that. And if the Google Assistant is turned off from the top over there, you want to make sure you actually turn it on because this is actually very necessary for the Google Assistant to work on your Android TV. So just go ahead and click on continue from the top and then just click on allow. Click on continue as well. Click on yes. And now we have successfully turned on the Google Assistant of our Android TV. So if I go back to the home of the Android TV now and then just try to use the voice control Google Assistant button, you should actually see the Google Assistant of your android tv now you can see mine over here i can just go ahead and give it instructions if i want and basically that is how to fix voice control google assistant not working on your android tv if you find this video useful please make sure you smash that like button and subscribe to this youtube channel guys